I'm going to play a game of solitaire for Japanese Mahjong, also known as Richi. If you're new to this version, look for information in the video description below so that you can learn the fundamentals. Also, there's a link to this player reference. It has all the scoring. You've got to have one Yaku to win. A Yaku is a scoring element. In this game of solitaire, I hope to have some opportunities to identify Yaku, be ready to win in six discards, and not deal in. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way, you won't miss anything. All my tiles have been mixed and built into walls next to the risers. This way, we can keep track of the progress of the game, based on how many tiles are left for picking. I'm going to deal the tiles now. Player 1 will get 14 tiles. Players 2, 3, and 4 will get 13 each. Then we're going to look at everybody's hand, see if we can identify some potential Yaku. Everybody has their tiles. Let's flip Dora. Four bam is Dora. Let's look and see what we can do for player one, also known as East. For this player, we have a lot of number tiles, single honors. We have a pair of twos. I think I would play Pinfu, all three in a sequence. Stay concealed and maybe play Ricci. Ricci, Pinfu. If we draw well, we could maybe even play all simples. Two through eight. Discard these. All simples is called Tanyao. Tanyao, maybe Pinfu, maybe Ricci. Three different Yaku potential here. We do have two pair, but we could maybe break that up and use it as a Chi. Five, seven. We have a six, eight, and a seven, eight. There is potential for mixed triple Chi. Six, seven, eight in each suit, although it's a little light right there. We'll see what happens. The nice thing about that is six, seven, eight are simples. Let's see what we can do for player two, also known as South. For South, We have single honors, five bams, two cracks, three dots, including a pair. I'm thinking for this player, if we could get a one bam or a three bam, we might be able to play a pure straight, which is called, I think it's called Itsu. Yes, pure straight, Itsu. We need a one bam or a three bam, but we can seven, eight, nine chi, four, five, six chi, one, two, three chi. So it's light right here. I think I would try pinfu, all chis, discard those. Let's see what we can do for player three, also known as West. East, South, West. They have a pair of their seat wind. We could do a pawn of their seat wind. That's called Yaku High, and that is a Yaku. We do have two other pair. I would try for all pawn, which is called Toy Toy, but I would go for this first. 
because that alone will allow us to win with just even that as the only Yaku. If we could pair up though, Toy Toy is a two Han Yaku. So that would be a really nice addition. So let's see if we can pair up and pwn. Yakuhai, maybe I'll pwn. Yakuhai and Toy Toy. Let's see what we can do for player four, also known as North. They have a pwn of eight dots. I think what I would do here is probably go for Pinfu, break this up, use that as a pair, and hope to use this for maybe a Chi, because we do have a Chi right there and a potential Chi here. The rest of these are isolated, the one five and the seven, and even the eight. I think I would try for Pinfu here. So we're gonna start by discarding. If we're gonna play all simples and maybe Pinfu, we need to get rid of these valued honors. All the honors, actually. So we're going to discard East. And now it's this player's turn. Nobody can take East. So we're going to draw. I'll use this to mark whose turn it is. And I forgot to say it's the East round. Six dot. Now that's no longer isolated. We have a potential Chi here. Let's discard North. Nobody can take it. One dot. Potential Chi. We wanted to pair up here though. This, this could potentially bring score. We have a pair of sixes and a pair of fours. I was thinking maybe we could do outside hand where you have ones and nines in each block or wins and dragons, but we'd have to throw away two pair. I would not recommend that here. I would say leverage the pairs. So let's discard. Inside tiles, which are more efficient and therefore useful to other players will keep the outside tiles. Six ban. Let's see if that is the right choice. We'll keep these because they're already paired up. So six ban was discarded. Nobody can take it. So we're going to draw. Oh, we have a con. Four of a kind. Oh. I think we should just stay concealed. Oh, I just realized this is Dora. I forgot to account for Dora. Four Bam is Dora. We could maybe use it here in a Chi or here in a Chi. Here, we should just do that alone and then have Dora. Well, we'll see. We need to make a decision up here. Because we have a con of eights, I'm kind of thinking we should maybe leverage that and try for all simples. Because we can't really use that as a chi unless we get seven, six, seven, nine, and we have none. So I say let's keep let's keep simples and discard honors west. And here we're going to pwn. So this is the player on my right. So we had a pwn here. Let's discard. That could potentially bring score if we can pair it up. Let's go ahead and discard eight bam. And draw. Two bam. Okay, that could be a potential chi. Let's get rid of white dragon. See if we can play all simples, which means we'd have to discard the ones. And we have a chi here and a potential chi here. 
I'm just wondering if maybe we should use this as a pair and keep one of these for a chi and discard the other one. I don't know. Let's just keep it for a bit and see what happens. So white dragon was discarded. Let's draw. Eight crack. We've got a pair in here. So now we have one, two, three pair. Oh yeah, we were gonna maybe do all simples. Well, that worked out nice, because it's a simple, two through eight. Let's discard north. Ooh, red dragon. Well, I didn't really plan on that. We could do Red Dragon Pwn alone. That's also called Yakuhai. So let's see, we discarded a North. We have a potential Chi inside. We were thinking maybe a pure straight here. Let's discard five crack. We could do Yakuhai alone, maybe. Five crack, nobody can take it, so we'll draw for West. Seven crack, we paired up. Well, that worked out nicely. Um, why do they not have enough tiles? This is in the wrong place. Okay. They have a pwn of their seat wind out. That's called Yakuhai. And then we have the potential for three more pwns. I think we should try for Toy Toy in addition to Yakuhai. So let's discard. We have one, two, three. We just need a pair in here. Let's discard seven bam. 7 bam. So we want to pwn here. And we might be able to pair up if we can get another dragon. We could get a do another dragon pwn there. So we're going to draw here because nobody can take that 7. 6 dot. Okay, so that creates an opportunity for a chi. So this would make that isolated pair Potential chi, potential chi, there's a chi, isolated, potential chi, isolated. So let's see if we can still do pinfu. We might sacrifice the eight unless we draw another chi tile. So let's go ahead and discard. Actually, you know what? If we could leverage that pwn, potential chi, potential chi, potential chi, isolated for all simples. That's two discards that way. If we were to discard that and do Pinfu and Richie, let's say, we would have two discards. It's one, six, one half dozen the other. Playing all simples though would leverage that eight and we could claim discards okay i think we should go for all simples mm, this is a hard one okay sacrifice the eight leverage this made chi there potential chi Potential, or that is a chi. One, two, three, four, and a pair. That makes this set, but we have three discards. Here's a side weight, which you need for pinfu. Let's discard seven crack and just see what happens. Give ourselves a little time to decide. Seven crack. Right here, pwn. So this would be the player to my right.
All right, so we have another pwn out. Let's go ahead and discard this single green dragon. That, that will get more and more dangerous as we hold on to it because it, it could bring value to somebody else. All we really need here is a pair. So green dragon was discarded. Nobody can take it. We're going to draw. Two crack. Okay, now we paired up a simple. So here we have a pung, potential chi, potential chi. We have a potential pwn there or a chi. Let's get rid of this five bam. That is a good tile for potential use with uh, Dora, but we're kind of narrowing in to ready to win, which is also called tenpai. And that five is isolated right now. So let's go ahead now and draw for east. South. We're trying, I think, for all simples. South, and nobody can take it. 3 bam. Oh, we got we got that potential chi now for pure straight. They have that potential for pure straight. Let's focus there and discard nine crack. Nobody can take nine crack, so we'll draw. Five bam. Let's discard nine crack. Six crack. Okay, now that is another simple, but it is isolated. So let's see. Pair, potential chi, potential chi. There's a chi, one, two, three, potential chi. We really don't need the six unless we hold it and try for all simples, where we could use that as a pawn. Chi, chi, potential. Potential pawn. Isolated, isolated, if we get rid of the ones. So we would have one, two, three, four blocks. We're still kind of short. It would allow us, though, to call tiles to pwn. Okay, so let's say if we go for all simples, we would have two discards. If we go for pinfu, let's say we would have three discards and we have one two three four five we have all our blocks including a side weight i think that's what we should do let's discard six crack it's isolated so let's stick with Pinfu. Six crack was thrown. We're going to draw. And actually, this player could chi if we play Pinfu, but I'm thinking we have three pair. We could do all simples in Toy Toy, all simples, all pwn. Let's stay concealed and draw. Four crack. That's a simple. It's not a multiple though. Let's discard red dragon and focus on number tiles. Here we're going to pwn from the player on the left. And now we'll discard green dragon, which has already been thrown. Now here we want to chi here for a pure straight if we can. And this could be our pair, so I think we could discard these. We have all the chi potential we need for a pure straight with a dragon pwn. Green dragon was thrown. Let's draw. Last tile, second wall. We paired up. That's what I was hoping for. Potential pwns through here. So let's discard five bam. And it will be this player's turn. Eight crack. Oh, that's six crack. That could have been a potential chi. All right, well, it's isolated, so let's stick with it. 
So that was the sixth discard. And nobody is ready to win. This player is the closest. They need one more pawn in here and they'll be ready to win on a double weight. Let's draw. Three dot. That is a simple with chi potential. We have a potential pawn, potential chi, potential chi. That's a terminal. We need to discard that. Here's a potential pawn. These are isolated. Here's a potential pawn, uh, potential chi isolated. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, wait. One, two, three, four, five. We have everything we need. We can discard this and these. For Tan Yao and maybe Richie, if we can do it concealed, let's discard one crack. Let's just see what happens. Nobody can take one crack, so we'll draw. Four dot. We paired up again. Okay. So we have a pone of dragons out. One, two, three. Pure straight potential and a pair. Let's discard. Let's see here. Maybe we should just do Yakuhai alone and break this up and hold that for a potential chi and take whatever comes. Because this is three blocks away. Maybe we should expedite since we're in the middle game now. We really don't need this because we do have a pair of nines. Maybe we should keep this and discard the nine instead. and use this as our pair or a chi to expedite. Either way, we don't need both pair. We have Yakuhai already made, and this is a potential for a pure straight. We don't need this many blocks. So, let's discard, let's discard the six dot and just use one of these. Oh, pwn. Pwn from the player on the left. And they're on a double weight for all pwn and their seat win pwn, which is Yakuhai and Toy Toy. So we're gonna discard one dot. Ready to win, double weight. Drawing four north. Four bam, that's Dora. Let's keep it. There's a potential chi. Maybe we can get them to Tanya. Let's discard one bam. We're going to draw down here. Now this player needs that one, but you cannot chi from the player across from you. You can only chi from the player on your left. So let's draw. Five crack. Okay, we have chi potential there. Pair, chi potential, chi potential, or pwn potential. We have one, two, three pair. This could help us with Dora if we draw it. If we discard either one of these, we'll leave these isolated. At least here, we could maybe chi for Tanyao, all simples. All these are tied into potential cheese. This is a bit redundant, actually. Let's keep that because it could help us with Dora if we draw a four or even a five or even a two bam. Let's go ahead and discard seven crack because we already have chi potential here. That is a side weight. We have too many pair though. All right, well, we'll see what happens. We're still concealed, so we could potentially reach you. So seven crack was discarded. We're going to draw. Eight bam. We paired up now. All right, one, two, three pair. Pure straight 
is going to take, I think, too long. So I think we should focus on the potential to pwn. None of these are out. Let's switch to Toy Toy and try to pair up one more time. So let's go ahead and discard three BAM because I don't think we're going to be able to use Dora and I want to get rid of these Dora helpers. The tiles that can be used maybe in a Chi, for example, around Dora. Even that one. These three will discard unless we pair up. So three BAM was thrown and here we're going to draw five crack. They are ready to win. Nobody can take five crack, so we will draw. One bam, we already threw that. We're going for all simples here, maybe. Let's draw down here. One bam, nobody can take it. Second one, by the way. Seven bam, that's a chi right there. Three bam was thrown. No fours are out. I'm thinking we should do Tanyao and maybe Pinfu. Side, nope, that's not, that's a closed weight. Here's a side weight right here, two, three. We need a four dot. A one dot would throw us out of all simples. Let's discard this three bam. Okay, six, seven, eight. Two, three, side weight, isolated, potential chi, potential chi in a pair. One, two, three, four, five blocks. So I think that looks good for Pinfu and all simples. And Richie, if we can do it. We're two away from ready. So three BAM was thrown. Let's draw. Nine BAM. Oh, no. Darn it. Oh, shoot, look, we got that 789 Chi. All right, well, let's just stick with it. Nine BAM. We'll stick with the plan for pones. Nine BAM, nobody can take it. Four crack. Now up here, Here, we could potentially chi and still do all simples. Pwn, potential chi, potential chi, potential chi. There is a chi. Let's stay concealed. I'd like to see if we could have them reach chi. Let's draw. Seven dot. Okay. Pwn. Chi, side weight. They're not quite ready. Let's see here. Pone, chi, potential chi. Here's a chi. We have two potential chis. I was trying to see if we could get them to pin foo, but we have too many eights. We discard the eight and use that as a pair. We're two away from Ricci if we draw a three bam and there's already two out. I'm just thinking maybe we should try for all simples. Since there are two three bams out. You know what, let's get rid of the one crack so they could have at least all simples, Tanyao. And they could call for a pwn here. If they can't end up doing this concealed, we can switch to claiming a discard to get to a win. Let's just see. We're going to draw for East. One BAM. They would have been able to chi that. The four BAM though is missing here. And it's not been discarded yet, so somebody's holding it right there. Let's draw four crack. Nine dot. Pone. Pone. 
player on the right. Okay, so we want to pwn here, pwn here. Let's get rid of 2BAM. Nobody can take it, so we'll draw south. One crack. We already threw it. Let's just get rid of it. Stick with Tanya. Three crack. We've got a chi in there. Three, four, five, pair, potential chi, side weight, chi here. We already have a pair. Let's discard five dot. We're one away from ready on Pinfu and all simples, Tanya. Pinfu and Tanya. We need we need a six dot. And then we'll discard this two to be ready to win. We'll reachy, reachy. All simples, which is Tanya, and Pinfu, which is all cheese. And then Richie, that's three Yaku. Let's see if we can get there. Here we're going to draw six crack. Nine bam. One bam. South. Six bam, we paired up. Okay, all right, all hope is not lost here. We just need to pwn. Let's discard five bam. South. Three crack. Okay, here now we have potentials for pwns. Okay, let's expedite this hand and call for discards with these potential pawns and play Tanyao. Let's discard 2BAM. That means we're gonna have to discard Dora. Mm. There are two 3BAMs out though. The chances of them getting that and they already have two pair there. We don't need that many. We have one, two, three, four, five. Really we're one away from Ricci and all simples. All right, well, let's draw down here and see what happens. Four dot. Okay, there it is. We're going to reachy. So, no, we can't. Let's see. We could reachy alone. Let's see. Hold on a second. Let's not reachy because we need a side weight. If we do two, three, four and discard the two dot, we would have a five, seven potential chi, but that's a closed weight. For pinfu, you have to have a side weight. So instead of re doing a reachy now, we could break this up, discard the seven and have two side weights. Either way, we were gonna discard this two. So yes, we are ready to win on a six dot. None are out. No, there's a pwn of six dots out. There's a pwn of six. There's only one more six dot left. Okay. One more six dot left. If somebody discards that, Pinfu will be dead anyway. Let's reach ye. If somebody thinks the six dot is available, then we could win by discard for Ricci alone. Oh, and we have all simples. Tanyao. I forgot about Tanyao. They're okay. Tanyao. Chi, chi, chi pair. This is their chi. We're waiting on a six dot. Okay, so we're going to draw here. Oh, Roan. Roan right here. So that's their pair.
we have all pone, toy toy, seat wind pone, yakuhai, two dora, that's four han. Wait, no. Yakuhai is one, toy toy is two, so that's three, four, five. We have mangan. Mangan. We don't have to count many points. Woohoo! If you are new to Richie Mahjong and you have a set at home, try playing solitaire. It has helped me learn the Yaku and it has helped me with some decision making. You are playing in a vacuum though, so it's really best to play with other people, whether online or live. But there are benefits of playing solitaire. You can focus on one hand at a time, make sure that you're not biased by what is in each of the other player's hands, and there is much to learn. If you haven't already done so, download this player reference so that you can study the Yaku. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next solitaire for Japanese Mahjong, also known as Richi, may all your picks be keepers.